Morning, we're back today on the build. I'll just show you it in a minute. It's a bit rainy today, so I think we're gonna we we'll save one day that we can do uh, on inside of it, on inst uh, on extension that we left just purposely for a really bad day. So that's what we're gonna do today, I think. So we'll uh, we'll take a look inside, see what see what we've got. Looking quite well though now. Really comes up nice that stone. You don't uh, just don't smudge it. Don't do Oh really? It uh, just looks nice as old when you lay it. Right, let's uh... So this is inside. We've just been chucking all this junk from the scaffold down because that's as damp look. So we're gonna be uh, 100 concrete, 100 insulation, maybe a bit more, I'm not sure. And then all that's got to be filled, about 300. Uh, so we've just been dumping all this well, oh, just chucking it through the window look. and then here. So today uh, we've got to finish. We've got to get a lintel in here, um, work that round to the ceiling, and then we've got noggins in here, and we've just got uh, we've got them in this bit. Well, this bit's undone. We never did noggins in here. Uh, we just saved them for a bad day, so we'll uh, we'll get noggins in there and get that finished off. And some bolts through that because we never bolted that. So that is what we're going to be doing today. Oh, this is that wall that went over. We've got to put a strap uh, down back of here, and this is how we did it to stop it from uh, blowing over. So we bedded a strap in here, look, bolted it to the wall, and then it's got a strap up back that just needs taking off and bolting properly because we only bolted about that high. So we've got some more to put in there and strap it up. But this wall's uh, pretty solid now. That prop ain't doing out. Take that out. That's just got to... We screwed it so it won't go anywhere, but it's just slack at minute, so uh, the wall's taking all the weight. Right, anyway, let's crack on. Put two lots in, 1.6, 1.6. So the easiest way to do it and keep them straight is to just go get laser out. So let's mark that at 1.6. Put a line on. Other side, you don't need to be perfect, right? But it's better if uh, you can get them something decent. One six, you need to buy yourself one of these as well for about three quid. Can't get over it, it's a lot easier than it. Tim's got the old one, it just keeps falling out of his pocket. Right? Drop it every day. Mine's a <laughs> The, the bob on there. I did have to roll it though, I had to sand that down so it went in a bit so it were a bit tight. Uh, but three quid, really good. So this is laser, we've just changed battery. It had loads left, but I'm pretty sure I left it on when I put it away. Uh, but we've had it a couple of weeks and we've just changed battery now, but I'm sure we've only just changed it because it's gone uh, flat when left off. So now we'll get laser out. So laser and Messing about, measuring and putting lines up. So I'll put it on first line here, and then we'll look at that line, square it with that. And that's it, we're at 1.6. On Joyce. Yeah, so they're all on Joyce. And it's as easy as that. Uh, we've got one row in, it's uh, stopped raining. So whether 
Might put a mix on, and then if it rains, uh, just use mix right back in here. Uh, so I think we're going to try and do a bit of this stonework, but we'll see how it goes. We'll get a mix on first, see what it's like. Right, let's crack on. That'll do. We'll see if we can uh, lay a few stones while that rain stopped. I don't know. Uh, I don't know how much uh, we'll get done. Like, thought rain comes again. I oh, what? Nearly missed bucket. Yep. Yes, I did. Got a couple set out. Uh, last night, I normally uh, as we're brushing up and stuff, I uh, set a few out. Well, it says rain on and off all day, like, well, it, it said all all the time, but today, but it, we've got a dry patch at the minute, so. I think that one's a bit smaller, so what we'll do is we'll bang this down a fair bit, put a tight bed on this one. Got a little level as well, it's a lot easier with little level. Then we'll measure 13 and a half. 13 and a half. Trying to get it square. 13 and a half that way. Sticky mix today. I made a sticky and him. Very sticky. I haven't got it too runny today, it makes uh, just because I don't know what weather's going to do really. Running down a little bit, be alright. Don't matter too much if you're running down a tiny bit. You can't really tell which stones when you just get it back on next then. Are you ready to come up here, Tim? Start uh, putting a couple of water dry for me. It's raining already, I can feel it. We've got that block work to do anyway inside if it starts yeah. chucking it down, so we'll just use the same mix because it's only one course below um, ceiling. So we'll just use this uh, sand cement and lime mix we've got.
So that's this tray that goes in there. We'll just cut these down and then we've got weep holes every two stones. Uh, I need to finish off down there though. Done all the rest all the way around and uh, we've had to cut all backs off stone because they're just too wide for lintel because lintel's here, which has been a bit of a pain really, but that's why I didn't film any of it because it just takes ages. Sticking here at all, I wonder what. Hulk to the hill, about halfway, I'd say. About halfway. 18, 19, something like that. Mm. So we're back inside. Bit of king span down just to get up there. We're just going to put a lint on there and put these blocks through. Tim's on one again. <laughs> <laughs> That little job out of way. Tim's just under there finishing that other side on noggins, and I've just come up here because the sun's uh, sun's just come out. So I'm just going to point this up before it rains again. So just using this side of brush, go over it. And then just give it a little brush. Three minutes past two.
Tim's just fi- doing all that. Tim's just filling in. You was at rest that go up. You throwing it in? I you were throwing it in a minute ago. There oh, you go. Oh. Uh, it just disappeared. Yeah, well, yeah. It's just you just fill. We'll call you. Fill my cavity. <laughs> yeah, we wow, just. Uh, then free we didn't fill, so we just uh, use it gobble for filling them. I uh, I have found. Um, that. I don't even know what they're called, a socket. And we're going to put these these bolts in if it'll do it. I hope it'll do it, this drill. Um, never bolted that together, so we're just going to bolt that up. Not bad that. Thought that drill had struggled putting them in, but worked quite well. Not bad. I'm just gonna mark this uh, strap up to go in here. Uh, chisel it out. <laughs> Mark, oh. are you using a wood bit? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah look. Okay. Watch. Uh -huh. Not bad. <laughs> Better than masonry, isn't it? <laughs> All right. Then. Speed. <laughs> Not lost then, is it? I think so. Oh, one more there. Look. Mark, fill your holes in. Fill the holes. Need some screws, mate. <laughs> you forgot them of you, Mark. Forgot the screws. <laughs> Always put lines that side of holes up, and then you know where they're going. Then easier. I think your friend's back, Mark. Just need a few more for up there, and we're done. Yep, your friend's definitely back. It's called Mr. Dark Cloud. <laughs> right, that's it. We'll see you in the next one.
Don't forget to give us a like, subscribe, and a thumbs up. Thumbs up. And if you don't like it, well, just subscribe anyway. Just give us a subscribe. Why not? Just click button. Just click button. Even if you hate me, just, just click it. Click it. See you later. Bye.